Oh no, you have to. Yeah. You have to bend this down. Okay, we're going to be starting here pretty soon. Uh, so thank you. Thank you for coming. And we're going to be starting 50 hours of worship at 400, over 400 tents across America. Um, and we're just one of the little 400 locations around, going on, on around uh, America, basically. Started two years ago, and uh, last year there was over 200 tents um, going simultaneously, and this year there's over 400. So we really wanted to be a part of it, um, and, and it's really, it's really, there's not really any denomination or lifted up or anything. It's just all about Jesus, and that's been kind of the theme: is that Jesus go viral, that uh, the name of Jesus be lifted up, and that a lot of warfare be done. Um, for his glory because God is God is so worthy and so thank you for coming we're going to be you know seeking God and, and praying and breaking the land here uh, of uh, anything that's not of God and there just seems to be a lot of walls uh, that have been up here north in this area and we're just praying that this be a, a forerunner to really some breaking some breaking ground of, of uh of uh, just hearts, you know, being hungry for God and, and curses broke over the land. And, and I know over a hundred years ago, there were fires and some people said, well, maybe, maybe it's the fires uh, that broke out and, and making some people kind of hard or whatever. But we just really want to pray in this 50 hours and so into, you know, what God is speaking to the nations. And, and uh, uh, Cody James is going to be kicking it off uh, I believe I, he was a writer in the country scene for a while. I'll let him tell you the whole story, but you're going to be really wild. Uh, you know, God has really blessed him with a lot of talent. And he's like, it's like, man, I'm not feeling good. I got a cold and a, a chest. And, and but when he started singing, I'm like, wow, I, I couldn't even notice. And, and uh, so I'm really excited that he's, he's here. And um, we're hoping more people are going to show up. Or we're, we're live web streaming to so you people out there. Um, live. I hope you get blessed as well. And uh, I guess um, you ready, buddy? I think maybe just a quick prayer. All right. We could just bow our heads for a minute. Lord God, we just love you, God, and and we just want to be pleasing to you so much, Lord. And, and so we seek your your voice, and and we seek your heart, God. And we don't want to um, lift up anything of man's. We want to lift up what you're doing, God. We want to be part of what you're doing in our area, Lord God. And and so come, Lord, come into our hearts, come into our lives. Uh, give us words, give us words in these next 50 hours to preach and to pray. And, uh, and we just pray that you would just bless, double blessing on Cody James and his ministry and all that he's doing. And we just thank you for that. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. Thank you, buddy. God's good. Glad to be here. Just glad to be serving him. Simple way to serve him. All we have to do is stay out of his way. Your love, oh Lord, reaches to the heaven. Your faithfulness. Stretch us to the sky. Your righteousness is like the mighty mountains. Yeah. Your justice flows like the ocean's tide. I will be. Just to heaven, 
stretches to the sky Your eyes is a little It's like a mighty mountain Just as it goes, like the ocean's tides. Now we need my voice to her soul. I pray. I will lift my voice in the shadow. Yo 
I deserve my best, and he, he and you also deserve a guitar that will stay in tune. So until this thing temperaturizes, I'm gonna probably have to tune it after every song. People are like, I didn't know it was out of tune. I'm like, I do. Like, I really know it's out of tune. As soon as it gets as cold as my fingertips, we'll be good. <laughs> It's really good to be here. It is funny, no matter how bad I was feeling driving up here, get a little prayer, get here, and then start being a service, and it's like, all right, couldn't get better. So like some guitar players, they like don't do anything that might bother their hands for playing guitar. And I go out and like cut wood all day and stuff like that. So my hands get muscle bound and then I like want to tear my guitar into pieces. Hands go numb. But... All right, get some blood working in there. Well, I heard a thousand stories of what they think you're like, but I heard the tender whispers of love in the dead of night. You tell me that you're pleasing that I'm never alone. Good, good, good fire. It's who you are. It's who you are. It's who you are. And I'm loved by you. It's who I am. It's who I am. It's who I am. Well, I see that. Searching for answers far and wide, but I know we're all searching for answers. Only you. Pro- 
going back Cause you know just what we need to we Say a word, your good, good father It's who you are, it's who you are, it's who you are And I'm loved by you, it's who I am, it's who I am, it's who I am So undeniable, I, I can hardly speak peace. So unexplainable, I, I can hardly think as you call me. Deeper still as you call me. Deeper still as you call me Deeper still in the light You know, I'm super blessed that um, God um, he uses me at all, actually. <laughs> Completely honest. I think really that he uses me at all, because I know that doesn't really make sense, but maybe because I know that, that's why. I don't know, but um, I'm really super glad that he let me do music and gave me a guitar. I was a little boy and gave me a great Christian mom who, even though I would go opposite of God for the majority of my life, that because of the teaching she gave me, that it would bring me back around or bring me around to the real truth and, and I'd be able to take the music that he would flow through me and give it back to him by giving it to his people. But, so I say that because play some songs you've we've never met or been around each other that you probably never heard so I just want to give you a heads up there these are God's songs that you've not heard yet yeah. but they may seem familiar because the spirit that is within the songs and seriously I'll say and I've said it a million times and we'll say it a million more I just get to hold the pencil and it's pretty awesome that I do because uh, I get to see what his songs when I stay out of his way 
do for his people and for his people that don't even know they're his people yet. And that's really super exciting for me when I see people give their lives over to him. Um, anyway, so I'm going to play some of those. Glory and glory. <clears throat> Hallelujah. Since I lay my burdens down. Glory, glory. Hallelujah. Since I lay Down. One, two, one, 
Tingle and go Hallelujah Says I lay My burdens down Look great for Hallelujah Says I lay My burdens down I go better I feel better So much better Says I lay I'm burning I feel better So much better Since I lay My burdens down Go Lord So let go Hallelujah Since I lay My burdens down Go let go My friends don't treat me like they used to Since I lay my burdens down My friends don't treat me like they used to Since I lay my burdens down Go ahead, go ahead, I'll end it up Since I lay I'm going to help with Jesus since I live in my bird's eye. Glory, glory, hallelujah, since I live in my bird's eye. Glory, glory, hallelujah, since I live in my my burdens down, let's bring it up, burdens down. Burdens down, Lord, burdens down, Lord. Since I lay my burdens down. Burdens down, Lord, burdens down, Lord. Since I lay my burdens down. Going, going, hallelujah. Since I lay. My forehead's sweating. My fingers are. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. That's funny. I'm playing on the piano. He didn't know. There you go. Thank you, brother. I knew it would be like quick, quick. You're the man, buddy. You're awesome. You're awesome servant of God. Awesome brother. Awesome friend. You know, it's funny. You don't have to have everything figured out for God to use you. You just have to know that you've been saved and how grateful. Just in that gratitude, you know, you can go pass that on to a lot of people. And you're excited for the Lord and what he's done in you, man. I'll tell you what, that, that goes a long way. A lot farther than any degree, to be honest with you. When I first figured out 
and got saved, man. Hit my face and asked Christ into my heart and realized that it didn't matter what I had done all my life, how bad it was. He'd still give it himself for me. Took my punishment. Even though life wouldn't be a bowl of cherries, um, I know that I'm part of the winning team, the righteous team. And now I had information I could share with people that was uh, life changing. But in the beginning, God gave me a handful of songs and I'm playing one for you now. And I didn't even understand them or how powerful they were. And there's a reason for that. I won't go all into that now, but it's pretty cool how God works. This is my prayer for all of us tonight. This is a song that God wrote. He allowed me to hold the crayon called More Like You. Ha, ha, ha. 
remember growing up in uh, Oregon and I ran a trap line as a kid. And, uh, I remember my hands get so cold, I'd be skinning animals, you know? And I, was, I think I'm in the okay place to talk about that, but I'd be skinning animals and I had no idea. I was slicing my hands up until they thawed out. And that's, I was sitting there thinking about that as I'm playing. It's like, I'm telling my fingers what to do, but they aren't doing it necessarily. And you know what? I'm not even worried about it because. Yeah, I mean, there we go. Cool thing is God knows our hearts. See, that's just so cool. God doesn't really care that much about our performance if our hearts are right. It's true. Try to give God our best, but. I, I used to have a home, place I started from, a place to call my own. Some late nights, the devil took me on a midnight ride and left me out in the desert on my own. And now I feel alone. I need a hand to help me find my way back home. I'm a drifter. Oh, 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 oh,
to do things like this and it's like I'm glad that the freedom of what this is all about comes along with it because it's like I want to do what God wants me to do not what Cody wants to do and um, sometimes people get an idea that works if it's like I can't, I don't know, I can't see oh I got some water right here so yes thank you brother thank you so much she gave me some of that fancy water it puts electrolytes in your system or whatever I should have been drinking that like a week ago <laughs> Um, but yeah, the freedom to do. Some people think worship is just like brand new people think it's only it's only slow songs, but that's not true. Worship actually is not even just. I mean, it's music is just part of it, right? Right. It's how we live our life. Worship just begins in the heart and flows out from there. And, yeah. And, uh, so like, and I say that just in case anybody thinks that that you know what, so I'm playing some fast songs, but whatever. But it's the heart that. That's where the worship comes from, and that's what's contagious, too. That's right. Anyway, uh, this is one. Uh, <laughs> this is a song called Bold. Yeah. I don't play this song very much, but. Love it. Uh, it's, got a, it's got a strong message. And, and again, you know, I didn't write it, so God did. So it must mean he wants me to play it. <laughs> Amen. So, it's got a really strong message. There's, it goes by pretty fast, so I usually I'll stop right here and I'll just say, look, there's a there's a line in the song in case you miss it because it goes by kind of quick. Like I said, not as quick as okay, if I have a band with me, it goes by quicker because there's other people playing and it's like whatever. But there's a line in the song that says, the very last thing that I require or desire on my judgment day is a line of unsaved headed for hell screaming out my name. Really, what that means is, you know what? Don't miss an opportunity. The last thing that I truly want is to be, 
be my, my day to be getting judged by God and have him going, hey, you did okay, but look at all those people over there. You had an opportunity to share with them the freedom that, that I give and the love that I give and eternity, and you didn't for whatever reason. And I don't ever want to be that guy, so um, I just encourage everybody to not ever miss an opportunity to love on somebody or be embarrassed ever about the gospel. And, uh, hey, we don't fit in anyway. We don't. <laughs> anyway, this is called Bold. Here's a little story from long ago you may have heard before. Meshach, Shadrach, and Abednego, they stood up for the Lord. Bow a burden, they were told that I don't make it go. Believe they said we decline to your God nation. No, 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 they went go, 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 no harm came to those in the flame The king cannot believe They were walking around, hands unbound They were dancing with the king of kings They were go, 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 Jesus said in Mark 16, he said, go into the world Across your street, across your town, or to some foreign soil. Give us the power to be bold when we go in his name. Confess to all the love of God and never be ashamed. No, no, no. The very last thing that I desire on my judgment day is the light of an unsaved head of hell. Scream out my name. No, I'm gonna be bold. What a 
priceless gift yeah. Undeserved life And I've been given Through Christ crucified He called me out of death me into light I was under your wrath yeah now through the cross I'm reconciled yes I am Ooh, at the cross you beckoned me you saw me gently to my knees and I am Lost for words, so lost in love. I am sweetly broken, holy surrender. And to cross you, back in me, you show me gently to my knees. I am lost for words, so lost in love. I am sweetly broken. You haven't heard this one, I'm sure. I ain't played it in a while, so. Okay, I'm ready. I had to run that part that I usually mess up if I don't do that right there. But. You know, I do not consider myself a professional, and I have written songs and played music my entire life for a living. Bottom line is, I ain't never, I'm not out to put on a show. Never have been. Never didn't understand it before I got saved. Once I got saved, I got it. I figured it out. I ain't, there ain't, I ain't anywhere to put on a show. I'm not, God didn't give me whatever he gave me to ha entertain people. It's about being real. Anyway, there's a song called Wilderness. I don't know where it came from but it's old, like really, really old. I learned it from a buddy of mine in the deep south who is really, really old. 
And I said, where'd you get that song? He said, I don't know, because it's really, really old. <laughs> But I like it. it goes like this. Well, how happened did you feel when you come out of the wilderness? Come out of the wilderness. Come out of the wilderness. I, how did you feel when you come out of the wilderness? Leaning, leaning on the Lord. I said, well, how did you feel when you come out of the wilderness? Come out of the wilderness. Come out of the wilderness. I, how did you feel? Well, I looked in my hands, my hands look new. I looked in my feet, and they did too. I started to walk, I had a new walk. I started to talk, I had a new talk. I started to sing, I had a new song. I started to pray, I had a new prayer. I started to dance, I had a new shout. Because Jesus has got me out as a How did you feel when you come out of the wilderness? Come out of the wilderness, come out of the wilderness. How did you feel when you come out of the wilderness? Lean on the Lord. Did your soul feel happy when you come out of the wilderness? Come out of the wilderness, come out of the wilderness. Did your soul feel happy when you come out of the wilderness? Leaning, leaning on the Lord. Well, I looked in my hands, my hands look blue. I looked in my feet, and they did too. I started to walk, I had a new walk. I started to talk. I had a new talk, I started to sing, I had a new song, I started to pray, I had a new prayer, I started to dance, and I had a new shout, because Jesus had brought me out as a loud as a view when you come out of the wilderness, come out of the wilderness, come out of the wilderness, I had as a view when you come out of the wilderness, leave. This is fun. God. I am a friend of God. 
Cross before me, the world behind. No turning back, raise a banner high. It's not for me, it's all for you. Let the heavens shake and flip the sky. Let the people clap their hands and high. Now for us, it's over you. Not to us, to your name. Oh, this is one of them songs I should have done the little rehearsal thing for before I started it. <laughs> All right, oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, I don't know. I may be able to just move on. And... Okay, forget that happened. Nothing like live streaming. <laughs> Yeah, I know people who know me are like, yeah, that's classic for him. That is classic Cody. You know, I was one time I was doing a song at the piano, one that I had, God had let me write, and it's like I got to the middle of this song. I totally forgot this verse. It just went away. Like I had no idea. Smoothly, I went right into the chorus, and nobody ever knew anything, and I'm thinking to myself, <laughs> they don't even know. And you know what? God, like, I felt God, like, smacked me up the side of the head. And um, kind of like a daddy would do, like, hey, boy. And uh, said, stop, tell everybody what happened, go back and repeat that, that second verse. And so I did. And you know what was funny is that when I got done with the concert and I stopped and I was talking to people and praying with them afterward, this, it turned out.